The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Los Angeles, California, Selena. Social media has been buzzing since this match was announced, and I think the competitors plan on delivering on that hype. A competitor who is always laser focused on the competition. I expect big things from her tonight. From fabulous to untouchable. Here comes a self-proclaimed Emil's beautiful woman in all of WWE. Saxton, how many times do I have to tell you many other people make the same proclamation? This is the most beautiful woman in all of WWE. That is my unbiased opinion. Yeah, sure it is. And from Staten Island, New York, Carmella! Carmella's proven herself as one of the most talented in-ring competitors. But according to Carmella and Corey, she's also the best looking. According to many people, Cole, you clearly just don't speak to the right people. Well, Byron told me she wasn't best looking. Why are you being a snitch, Michael? Would you take the advice on whiskey from someone who's never had a drink? I don't think so. Gone are the days of moonwalking, the trash talking remains, and let's be honest, I think we were all a little bit over the dance break thing. Hey, I miss those dance breaks. You're the one. Hard not to be excited when the superstar is in the ring. A competitor who has no limits. She wouldn't know her limits if they were right in front of her, Michael. Some might think she's reckless at times, but it's impossible to get her to change her ways now. And I wouldn't expect her to fight any different in this matchup either. And then you have the untouchable Carmella. Some have a misinformed opinion about Mella as a superstar who just runs her mouth too much. Anyone with that view is drenched with envy, knowing that every time the bell rings, Carmella is able to back up every truth she speaks. Uh, I don't know if I would completely agree with all of that, Corey. I will not deny that Carmella has been, on occasion, known to put her money where her mouth is once that bell rings. Carmella loves to run her mouth, but there's no denying that she's also about as vicious as they come. Corey, what do you think Carmella should rely more on here? As much as Carmella's trash talking has served her well in the past and continues to do so, ultimately she needs to focus on just being as physically vicious as we know she can be. Look at this, going counter for counter. And she's stunned to the corner. Perched on the middle row. She cinches Mella in. Oh. Perfect position, uh-oh. Going for her. Looks like the moon lock. The bridge is in. And for some reason, she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. Mella able to defend against that. Well scouted reversal there. Byron, in the world of romance, this is what we call seen that move before. And like clockwork. Carmella <laughs> might decide it here. And, two. and a kick out. No one saw that coming. How did that not end things for her? She's showing incredible resiliency. And Carmella really thought she had the top. Big mistake there, Corey. But she knows that now. to the lower back, clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here, relentlessly. 
Oh, foot just stomping down. Arm trap. Precision strikes. Kick to the midsection. That was a great risk here. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. Wow, a tremendous win in this match. Have all the fun you want, but at the end of the day, this is what it's all about. Winning and making money in that order.